the uh, Faluda, the strawberry flavor. I've heard a lot about it, just never got a chance to try it. It has noodles in the bottom, their own in-house made batter, ice cream, jelly, as well as nuts. It even smells better than actually it looks. So let's give it a try. I'm gonna try to see if I can get everything in one bite. Oh my goodness, it's just dripping. Wow. It's hard to describe it because you get so many different textures and as well as flavors that batter, as well as the ice cream, the jelly, and the nuts. This is something that you guys got to try because it's really, really unique and I don't think anywhere else serves this. So they got a ton of other flavors as well. Let me show you guys. So here are the Faludas. They got rubbery, which a Z who's behind the camera is going to try it right after me. There's pond. There's kulfi, which is basically like a South Asian ice cream, and as well as other ice cream uh, followed that which you get to choose uh, your favorite uh, flavor. So let me have another bite because this for sure is delicious. Check it out, guys. They're in Pile Center in Surrey. Uh, I think it's 128 in 80. 284-ish area pile business, pile business uh, center just around the corner addresses in the description you guys can check them out come see them try this one the strawberry faluda is their best seller wow the bottom is warm and you get those noodles and the top you have the ice cream so this is the rubbery uh, flavor and this one also has their uh, house made uh, batter gel jelly nuts and the noodles like check it out so many different cool colors but this one is a little bit more liquid than the last one because the last one actually had uh, ice cream and now you guys might be looking behind me like what is this there's leaves in here. That's actually for pond. So stay tuned. We're gonna try this, and after that, we're gonna have some pond as well. For so this rubbery, let's see how it is. Oh wow! That's so creamy, and has a taste of like rose water. Mm. Super good. Wow. I'm gonna try to see if I can take a container of this home because this is one of my favorite ones because you can just actually use the straw and it has a lot of different flavors and it's thick and creamy as well as that uh, hint of rose water. Wow. Stay tuned guys. I'm gonna continue working on this. We'll be right back with the ponds. This one's actually made with silver. They actually have pieces of silver like this that they put on top of it and they have a lot of ingredients. So they ha it has coconut, dates, uh, fennel, rose water, rose syrup, and rose petals and a bunch of like other uh, stuff. So you can see it's full of stuff. And then on top, you get two pieces of the silver, one at the bottom, one on top. But what you're supposed to do is just basically have it as one bite. So this is one of my first couple of times that I'm trying this. So let's see how it goes.
So what you're supposed to do is actually savor it. Keep it in the side of your mouth and slowly chew on it. That way you can get the juices, the flavors from the rose syrup, rose water, rose petals, date, um, as well as coconut and a bunch of um, other spices that they put like fennel and, and uh, whatnot. So it's really, really good. Once you eat it, there's a punch of this flavor, this sweetness, is like sourness and you get like that rose water. It's really, really good. And then when you have it slowly, the sweetness goes down a bit and you get all of those flavors, but they're not as strong as it is at the beginning. And it's pretty good. I think, you know, if you're just had, you know, for example, lunch or dinner or a snack and you want to basically have something sweet, it's really good to uh, try. So they got a bunch of different uh, flavors here. They got the gold one, silver, and then a bunch of the other ones that they make uh, in-house. So you guys can come in and check them out. And like I said, this is one of my first couple of times that I'm trying it and overall I actually enjoyed it. So two thumbs up.